All right, everybody, it's time for more Custom with the Elite in this time we're in episode 8 of season 2. I am really ready to just jump straight into this one. So before we get started, if you are watching this over on YouTube, then definitely check out the Patreon for full length access as well as early access to any other shows and movies that we are watching on the channel. And even things that haven't made it to the channel yet. But aside from that, let's stop talking and jump straight in. All right, for the Patreon people, we are going to get started in 3, 2, 1. Kicking it back off with Kushida. You're the ones with the problems. Oh no. All she did was tell the truth. Oh, that transition. God, I'm so interested in her past. Oh God. <laughs> I'll take part in both groups as much as I can. Oh no. That means she's always gonna be able to keep an eye on um on Harikita. I don't trust it every time she leaves. I bet you she's she's going to see a uh, rewind or something. ペアになったんだが、お互いテストの得意不得意が被ってて困ってる。すでに勉強会の人数は限界に近いわ。How can you study for something though when the questions aren't you, you don't know what the questions are? だったら俺が面倒を見る。雪村くん、いいのかい？悔しいが個人じゃ腕上げだ。今必要なのは全てを補えるチーム。団結か。雪村くんたちの勉強会に参加してもらうわ。なんで俺が雪村くんと同じグループだったわね。多少は融通が効くんじゃないかしら。We haven't seen Sakura at all this season it feels like. というわけで。She actually gonna step up. メンツで勉強会だ。綾野コーチくんと喋るんだ。<laughs> this guy's usually invisible. <laughs> I mean, in his, in his case, it's good, you know? <laughs> She's just so unimpressed. <laughs> yeah, he, he, he let it show a little bit that he's actually reliable. Oh、あ、ヘイトダブルダイアログ。そこをなんとかしろっつってんだよ。ケーキ。そういえば。そろそろ誕生日か。Oh、it's my thing too. It's just like how can you prepare for something when you don't know what to study for? So I know exactly where this boat draws the line. We'll have a stronger footing. Okay, well. Alright, Ananakoji. Let me prepare some questions. So intentionally ask crazy questions to see, you know, how crazy you can make them? Okay, that's, that's actually smart then. クシダはどうだった対シークラスの問題作りには、クシダは関わっていないんだよな。情報の開示は避けている。けれど、それだけでは解決しないんでしょう。Yeah, I mean, they need to talk about her wanting to expel them, you know what I mean? Uh oh, is it Kushida? That's the mine. Oh, Ryuin! Who are you? Oh, shit. どうしたの? I have a feeling Rewin's gonna get dangerously close to um Ayana Koshi near the end of the season. Who, who is he talking to? Oh. <laughs> His partner. <laughs> they just don't click to me. Like... <laughs> わかってるって。さあさあ。ねえねえ、私どうやって勉強すればいいかな。一緒に頑張ろうね、あやなこじくん。Oh, 
<laughs> oh my god, this girl really is um persistent, I'll say that. <laughs> Even they're already noticing it. <laughs> Damn. I wonder how long they studied for. Oh, I don't like you. I was hoping we'd get more backstory from um her um from Kushida, but I guess it's still too early. They really want to keep her a mystery. Yeah, it's not. I just don't want her to do this by herself because she's dealing with not only Kushida but, but Ryuin as well. I don't want her to do this by yeah. Yep. <laughs> I hate the way she says it. It's just so sweet. Oh, God. Is Kushida really that smart, though? I mean, I guess we never really seen her scores, huh? She doesn't seem worried. Oh, that's the, oh. <laughs> oh, <laughs> never mind. <laughs> Not overall test scores. I want to compete in one of the eight subjects we'll be testing in our finals. Okay. Oh, she's putting the ball in her court. Oh. Ayana Koji. <laughs> But he's going to be a conflict of interest. Oh! Damn! She got her own brother to do it. <laughs> yeah, I don't give a fuck. <laughs> if your sister gets a lower test score than I do, she's the one who proposed this deal to me. <laughs> I have no intention of interfering. I think he's a good um spectator, you know. Ooh, that smile. She's showing. Oh, <laughs> what? Oh, shit. <laughs> If you lose, I want him to go too. If I beat your mask for Hikata. I like Ayana Koji being expelled too. I knew it. I knew she was going to do that shit. Two birds, one stone. <laughs> oh. I'm more pressure on Hikata, of course. But that means I add a condition of my own. Oh! I want you to tell me exactly what happened with you in middle school. I think I have a right to know. Yeah, I mean, like, if you're putting him in the middle of this. True. And you're acting on the assumption that Hurikita knows what happened, right? And she doesn't. All she knows is rumors. She's gonna be like, okay. This is what I wanted. Okay. Let's listen up. I do this in every attention. So awesome. So she's a narcissist. I did anything. I wanted to spot. Yeah, she's a textbook narcissist. God damn. Ooh. I soon found my limit. Yeah. No matter how hard I worked, academically or in sports, nobody gave me any more attention. Oh no. Take the spot away from a from a narcissist, then you lose, you know, your sense of self. Well, they do. It all clicks now, especially seeing her from season one. Like everyone, you know, gravitated towards her. And now we understand why. Ooh, that sound. If I don't suck it up. 
Oh my gosh, she's bleeding. Uh-uh. Ripped her hair out. She began talking shit online. Oh my, oh, I, I see where this is going to go. But one day, somebody found it. My classmates happened to find my blog. Oh no. I didn't use any names, but based on what I said, they all knew who it was. Oh shit. So I used my weapon. She aired everybody's shit out, huh? Oh no, Kushida! Who he's cheating with, who she's been badmouthing on the underground gossip website. Oh, Damn, anger and they turned on me, they seem to on each other. And then her voice goes back. Ooh. I love how we're, how we're seeing the dark side of a narcissist. I'll talk more about that later. This is really good. Damn, so she's just been like absorbing and absorbing all this information about her classmates. That's why for now I'm venting all my stress verbally and otherwise getting along. Flashback to season one, episode three, four, something like that. Damn. God damn, Kushida. The desire for recognition. The textbook narcissist that no one talks about. But promise you drop out of school if I win. Wow. This was good. This is insanely good. So we finally understand you know, the type of person Kushida is. But on the subject of narcissism, a lot of people think it's just like, look at me, you know, post a cute little picture, you know, and like of you having a lavish life and all that stuff. Because like, you know, nowadays everything is social media based. So what people think as narcissism isn't this side of narcissism, right? Where people want others to depend on them and in exchange for depending on them, they compliment them, gravitate towards them, come to them for more things, confide in them, all these other things that starts, that narcissists are, you know, feed off of. And obviously being there for people isn't a bad thing. They're not saying that, you know, confiding in your best friends and stuff is, you know, the act of narcissism, but weaponizing that the information that you get and also not just weaponizing it, but also absorbing more of that information just for, you know, further validation of how great you are, that's where it becomes narcissism. You know what I mean? But this is good. I've never seen an anime, honestly, I've never seen another, you know, show or anything like that go this deeply into the dark side of narcissism. Because normally it's like, you know, obviously there's the, the popular girl trope. That's very, very, um, hold on. But yeah, like the popular girl trope is something that's very, very, you know, well played into. The biggest example is, of course, Mean Girls. I think everyone has probably seen Mean Girls at this point. But um, it, it goes deeper with, with Kusha. It's just, it's just because of the fact that it's not just her, you know, weaponizing this information that, that she's getting. It's getting deeper into the fact that it's affecting even her mental health and you know, even when she's moving schools, she's wa she wants to make sure that no one who knows about her past exists. Rather in, you know, someone like in, I forgot her name, in um, Re Regina George's shoes, it never really dived that deeply into how it affects her when people find out who she is. And I think now we're, we're seeing the form of narcissism when people do see you for who you are and what the narcissist does when they do see themselves as being backed into a corner. But um, obviously Kushida is trying to avoid being backed into a corner by getting ahead of it. 
And that's when she begins relying on the UN to um, to get what she wants in that department. But man, I'm really excited. Um, and also speaking on Ryuan, there is this whole thing um, with Ryuan emailing Ayana Koji back from the, I assume like the anonymous email that he used to start digging at who he might be. And honestly with Ryuan, obviously I don't think he expected for Ayana Koji um, to respond, but I think, or if he did respond, to respond seriously, but I think what Ryuan was looking for is little hints in how they spoke. You know what I mean? Because we know that Ryuan is very resourceful and he's mindful of, you know, how people talk. So I'm wondering if this is like Ryuan's first steps at, you know, picking away at Class D in particular to see who he's dealing with. But um, anyways, of course, if you guys are watching this over on YouTube, then definitely check out the Patreon for full length access, as well as early access for any other shows and movies that we are watching over on the channel. But I'm really enjoying this second season. I know a lot of people aren't liking it just because it might not match up with what you've read in the light novels, and that's perfectly fine. It's perfectly justified. But, you know, from somebody that's only watching the anime for the anime, I think they're doing a good job at, you know, expressing... The development in many different characters that we didn't really get much information on especially with with kushida i am 100 percent invested into exactly what is under her mask right and i'm glad that we finally did get to see her true self and who she was in middle school before this entire life in the new school that we're at but um Man, I, I love this. Anyways, you guys have a great rest of your day slash night, and I will see you next episode. Subscribe.